The ARC MIDI R2 by Fractal Design features massive airflow and highly flexible liquid cooling support. Click now to learn more. At long last, here it is finally, guys. Personal rig update number 16. No, I'm just kidding. This is my mod mic follow-up. So when I originally unboxed the mod mic, which is the detachable microphone that you can put on the side of any headphones, as you guys will probably know if you've been watching me for any period of time, I'm not a huge fan of most gaming headsets because generally speaking, they skimp on the actual audio quality in order to tack a mic onto them. So what I often recommend people do is use a pair of headphones. In this case, these are Sennheiser HD 5 55s, which I used to use, and use something else as a microphone, such as a blue desktop microphone or the mod mic. This is the Rev 3 one. Now, aside from promising a follow-up back when I did the unboxing, I also made some mistakes when I did the original unboxing. I didn't really configure it right. So for example, this, uh, this little clip right here is actually for clipping to the mod mic itself to reduce stress on the cable, not for clipping to the cord of your other device. So I would actually recommend doing that in some other way. I also didn't really configure it correctly in terms of the positioning. You wanna make sure you get things right beforehand. You don't wanna kinda of like bend it too much and then unbend it and rebend it. And uh, other than that, that was sort of most of the problem. The good news is you have a second chance because they do include another little magnetic piece so you can always kind of re it yourself. Um, and so I never provided that audio sample that I promised to provide because that was the big question from people is, okay, there's a solution where I can have better sound for myself, but what about the people on the other line? So for those guys, the good news is the ModMic Rev 3 does have a list of sound cards that it works with. The bad news is some onboard audio solutions in particular, it is not compatible with. So when I found out where we were getting an Asus Zonar Phoebus, which happens to be on the list of approved sound cards, which you can check out on their website, which is linked in the video description, I was like, oh, that's great. Now I'll be able to do my ModMic follow-up, and then I didn't really bother trying to find another solution. But this sat in the kitchen for like two and a half months while we were prepping and working on and planning and I didn't unbox it yet and then we were doing our extreme overkill buyer's guide, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, until finally then it sat on my desk for a little while longer until I finally installed it in my work computer and recorded the test audio clip. So without further ado, the mod mic. The most compelling social media cataract is to truly comprehend the expansive landscape from an editorial viewpoint during an aspiring potato's early career. So there you have it guys. It slices, it dices, it allows you to transfer it from one pair of headphones to another. You can actually get additional little clips if you want. I know they're working on a Rev 4 that's going to be even better. You can put it up like this, you can put it down like that, you could put it down here like this but I wouldn't really recommend it because you're going to get a lot of like throat vibration and Anyway, corner of your mouth is the correct position, and uh, there are lots of other correct positions too. It's all about personal preference. Thank you for checking out this follow-up video on the mod mic from Antlion. Don't forget to subscribe to Lion's Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it, or dislike it if you disliked it. I've got some people that are upset and think that I'm in a bad mood because I say I don't care if you like or dislike the video. No, I actually don't care because YouTube doesn't care. I get exactly the same boost in my search rankings and all those other good things if you like or dislike the video because they only care about engagement. So I hope that clears that up. Speaking of engagement, leave a comment on the video. Let me know what you thought about this and if you really think that I am on my period right now. It's very possible. We'll never know. Okay, I am. He'll hit the button at some point.